Hello and welcome to today's General Hospital Reaction. Hey everyone and don't forget to subscribe to our channel so you don't miss any videos or reactions. I'm not used to filming like this. I can't see my face. I'm very, very, you know, self-conscious. Okay, so uh, this week for Best of the Week we are voting for Best Character so make sure you vote down in the comments for who you think is the best character this week. I, this is really freaky. I'm so still looking at my face. I can't even. Alright, so I'm going to start out really fast. Um, Michael, I love you boxing, but seriously, I do not want to see you right now. Literally, li what? Tracy wants information that Michael doesn't have, so whatever. We really don't care about that. So, Sam and Patrick actually kiss OMG's goals, but neither of them are ready for a relationship right now, so they're putting themselves on the back burner, which is going to work out well because Jason's coming back. So excited. And Rob is coming back. So excited even more. So hopefully they can be with their respective spouses and everything will be happy once again. And now for the hostage situation. I live for the hostage situation. Although they're not so much hostages anymore. Uh, Lulu, like literally, figuratively, on fire. Her and Dante make a great team. I mean, they pretty much neutralize Stavros all on their own. And when Lulu made herself a human shield for Dante, like, that's so brave, I can't even, you know, like, not everyone would do that. And, yes, she kind of had the assurance that he wouldn't shoot her, but then it looked like he would shoot her, and bing, bang, boom, Lulu and Dante bring down the bad guys. Love them. Um, what else? Uh, oh, and <laughs> when finally the commissioner, they all bust in, and Dante's like, about time, commissioner. This episode overall had some pretty funny lines in it, I'm not going to lie. Um, and for Nathan and Maxie, you know I live for Nathan and Maxie. I know I live for Nathan and Maxie. And Nathan is, like, so amazing. He actually apologized to Maxie for crossing a boundary when she said she was confused and she didn't know how she felt. And, like, it's such a departure from all the other guys on the show, <coughs> Nicholas. And it's just so refreshing, and I absolutely love Nathan. And I guess that's proof that Nathan is not a Cassidyne, even though we know he's not. Um... And with Maxie, I love this, like, phase of Maxie right now. Like, we know Maxie. She goes through, like, sh different stages of evolution. I love Maxie right now. When she's like, I love danger. I'm holding a gun. I mean, I love her. I can't even. I can't even right now. Uh, Nathan really brings the best out of her. And Obrek shoots Victor, and we think he's dead. And I was like, I don't know. I can still kind of clearly see him breathing. And it turns out he's not dead. So I was right. And, um, so now, I don't know about you, but I'm kind of invested in who Nathan's father is. I kind of want to know. You, you have piqued my interest. Uh, and I kind of, uh, forgot Robin was a prisoner there. Like, I knew she was a prisoner, but I kind of, like, forgot. It went in the back burner on my mind. Um, like, I don't, okay, honest question. I don't know if Steve Burton's coming back. I was leaning towards he wasn't. But they keep showing his picture, like, a lot, and usually they transition the picture, or, like, they they just allude to the name, but they don't, like, show a picture, so I am thoroughly confused. If anyone has any, like, spoiler information, I would highly, highly appreciate it. Um, and <laughs> the whole Jason shrug when Robin was like, tell me you didn't pull out your innovator. That's what it's called, right, Mom? Um. I think so. Yeah, <laughs> and he's just like... Like, I start cracking up. Like, how do you make me crack up with just a movement of your arm? So whoever that is, props to you. And when he, when Victor pressed the button, I was like, oh, what, is there a self-destruct on the building? <laughs> Turns out there's a self-destruct on the building. Um, I don't know if any of you watched The Walking Dead, but it kind of reminds me of uh, something that happened. I was going to say specifically, but if you didn't watch it, I don't want to, like, spoil it for you. But you know what I'm talking about if you've watched the show. It kind of, like, reminds me of that. Uh, so, overall, I really liked today's episode. It was not, like, it was funny. I liked it. Uh, will they all get out alive? Yeah, probably. <laughs> and I think that's it for today. So, I will see you tomorrow for more German Hospital. I'm seeing Guardians of the Galaxy tonight. I'm really excited. And I hope you have a great day. Don't forget to subscribe. Bye. Cut it, Mama.